An alleged poison plot, a nurse at a Missouri jail charged with poisoning her husband and setting her house on fire so she could allegedly marry an inmate. Here's ABC's Maggie Ruley. Tonight, investigators are looking at whether an alleged prison romance was a motive for murder. This woman is accused of killing her husband while having an affair at work with an inmate. A 911 call first reporting a fire at this home in Iberia, Missouri at 2 a.m. back in December. Amy Murray, a nurse, first told authorities she drove to McDonald's with her 11-year-old son. And when she returned, the house was full of smoke and that the bedroom was on fire, with her husband, Joshua, found dead inside. But local authorities weren't buying it. It looked suspicious. The sheriff's office detectives came in with the fire marshal's office, started investigating it. An autopsy reveals it wasn't the fire that killed Joshua, but a chemical used in antifreeze. And Joshua was deceased prior to the fire occurring. Arson investigators confirmed the blaze was intentionally set in the master bedroom. Authorities say they then discovered her phone conversations with this man, Eugene Claypool, an inmate at the correctional facility where she worked. On the recorded phone calls, Amy admits to not wanting to be around her husband, saying she wanted a divorce. Now it's Amy who's facing life in prison, charged with first degree murder. Investigators say on those phone calls, Amy also told the inmate that they could now have a life because her husband was deceased. She has since been released on bond and is expected back in court next month. Tom. All right, Maggie, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.